Hi, am I Erskine? <laughs> it's not Erskine. It's, it's Erskine. <laughs> Hi, I'm Donald Clover. I'm Maya Erskine. And we're gonna take a little quiz about mm -hmm. little, 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 little. Okay, okay what was it? Was it? Tell me again. <laughs> oh, Kotar. Okay. Kotar. 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 I'm not tired. Hi, I'm Donald Glover. I'm Maya Erskine. And we're gonna test each other on how well we know our co star. That guy. I think I'm gonna eviscerate you. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, we got phones? Oh, we get fun. to keep these? Props. This is great. <laughs> the first time you met each other. New York? New York. Carbone. No, it wasn't in New York. It was in LA at Fran's house. Oh, we all, yeah. With, we all, all with all the writers. With all the writers and we all together. sat down and we talked. Mm -hmm. Their favorite memory from filming Mr. and Mrs. Smith. Smith. <laughs> You know. I, I know. You know, I feel like you know. I mean, I don't know, there were several, but one of them, the one I've talked about a lot. I don't listen to what I you know you don't. You don't retain anything I say. Most of the time? That one. <laughs> Is that your favorite? I mean, it's one of them. I loved it, shooting that one. <laughs> There's a part scene that you really, really I enjoy. I did. Yours? I, oh, I, I do know, but I don't think I said this out loud. No. My, Give a hint, because I gave you my, one. Yeah, my favorite restaurant in New York. Bouvet. Right. The Smith's house was there. Yeah. Oh, I loved shooting in the yeah, West Village. So that was, was really nice. Yeah, really nice. Favorite yeah. project of yours? Oh. Atlanta? Name Pen 15? Yeah. I'm like not sure Close if we're doing this good. correctly. We're not doing it I right. Feel like like she's over there, she's, she's like, like no. Yeah, I'll have to edit this oh my God. later. <laughs> I hate these guys. Okay, a former co-star of theirs that they'd love to work with again, ASAP. I know, Michaela Cole. Yeah. Her husband. Oh mine. Yeah, yeah. For you. yeah. Uh, <laughs> You're like, yeah. what the hell? I know, I'm what like, the what did the you fuck are you me, talking Donald? about? <laughs> Don't ever say Don't anything ever about Don't ever put his name in your mouth. <laughs> oh, you know this about me. Their Roman Empire, i.e. the random things they're always thinking about. Um, <laughs> lunch. Yes. <laughs> it's yeah. like lunch. Food. First of all, Maya's always knows what's next. She always just is like, mm -hmm. we're gonna get out of here at six because we got four more. Like, I'd be like, damn, I don't even notice. But oh. we always. I'll just put it in my butt. It's up my ass. Oh my God, was it up there before? It was up there and I was holding it. <laughs> just release. Mm. You, the random thing you're always thinking about, you're always singing in your head and you don't even realize it. Mm. So I feel like lyrics, music, notes. Yeah. I'm always making up little songs. Mm -hmm. The genre they'd like to star in next. You've been talking about a movie that you want to make. It's epic. It's mm -hmm. like a big action. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Epic. It's like action, sci-fi, you got in mm -hmm. shit. Sci-fi, right. You've done rom-com. Mm -hmm. I don't think like you're like itching to do it necessarily again, although you like it. And you've done Star Wars. You you like you like big acty moments. You like you like like, like sinking my teeth yeah, in. Yeah, you like sinking your teeth in. You hate it when I'm like you're really funny because you're like, I'm a serious <laughs> actor. <laughs> So I feel like you probably want like a drama, like a deep drama. I did, but now actually I'm like dying to do a comedy again. Oh really? Weirdly, yeah. Like a like a physical like That's Jim cool. Carrey like yeah, yeah. go That's... crazy. Okay, so I got that wrong. No, but okay. I would do no, it's I fine. want it's drama fine. too. You got the point. I'm a I serious didn't. actor. The TV show current or past that they'd love to guest star on. Sopranos. Sopranos. The most famous person in their context. Well, that's tough. Uh, on a metric level, probably Usher. But you just answered yours. Sorry. Usher. I don't know why I was gonna say Steven Soderbergh. I don't think I have him in my phone though. Oh, okay. I don't get in touch with him that way. There's um, a, a special way that Channing famous Tata? people get in touch with. No. Oh. <laughs> I'm just like exposing. No. I know your everybody. Are like... <laughs> hackers are like, oh. <laughs> that'd be nice. Oh, yeah. Usher. Yeah, that makes sense. For you, your dad. Not the most famous. <laughs> I guess it'd be Donald. One embarrassing. Of the that is so embarrassing. embarrassing. <laughs> the last text they sent you, you sent me a, a bar that was in New York and you're like, this place looks amazing. I did. What did I say? I remember what you said. <laughs> I'm telling you the last time you sent me something. Boba. I sent you like an oh, article shit. and I was like, you I took like, a screenshot, oh, a screenshot and you didn't it. respond. <laughs> Their favorite way to unwind after a long day on set. Watch something and eat something. And bath. Yeah, bath. Those yeah, three. Yeah, like just be warm. I just remember you talking mm -hmm. about like you just want to be warm. Yes. Something like ramen mm -hmm, or something mm -hmm, very mm -hmm, cozy mm -hmm. and watch something. Yes. Okay. Yours is watch edible Joe Rogan and, and like run. <laughs> I think you I did it. I feel like an ice, an ice bath. <laughs> no, I don't. <laughs> Not um, to unwind, but to you unwind. do think you did that ah. in the morning. <laughs> <laughs> Good night. Oh, no, so you amped. did. You 
just take an edible and relax. Yeah, I, I, I watch Talk something to your too. Family. Yeah, play with the kids. The role they're most proud of. I feel like it's Lando or Ernie. It's interesting. I guess I would say Pin 15. Yeah, it, I am. That's like that's a very a big personal and big yeah. undertaking in general. Would it be Atlanta for you because you created it, or would it be a movie that you were in? I think it's the or... same thing. But I feel like Atlanta. Yeah, yeah, can't beat that. Their go to karaoke song. Is it a Michael Jackson song? No. No, it's an older song. Think Batman Forever soundtrack. You too? No, no. Is it but I, it's interesting, but they are on there. Oh, I oh, that oh, song. Kiss by a Rose. There we go. Is Do you have bad? a good one? I don't know what I've you... been doing Disney songs lately just because I sound really good on them for some reason. <laughs> oh, That's really? like a good, I can show you oh, the really? world. <laughs> and then weirdly creep by Radiohead is like that a is, really good ballad for me. Has someone else done that? That is like the go-to white man song. Well, it's I'm like, not you're a like, white man. I know but you're I, not, but I, I don't know. know why you cho you chose it. I, I didn't don't know. mean to. It just came up, and I was like, wow, I can belt on this song. I think like, that's why that's it is. It's like why. no one sounds bad. It actually no helps if you bad. sound bad. Like, but you can't ah, really do. Yeah. 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 But I don't think you can sound because it's like yeah. I'm a creep. It's like yeah, the yeah, feeling yeah, of yeah. it. My mom's friend cried while I was singing it, and she was like, I was like. It's not that good. It's just not, she just uh, never heard that song. Like Woody Harrelson. That's his go to. Oh, really? Yeah. I'm, I'm a loser. loser. I'm, is it. What the hell am I doing? My, my 22 year old assistant is like, I don't know what the f you guys are doing. Um, oh, you know what's also good is cranberries. Zombie? <laughs> that was like one of the first singles I ever bought. Mm. But zombie is like the. Oh, yes. In your head. Zombie. Zombie. When we were doing karaoke, that when anyone was doing songs from the 90s, it was actually like very satisfying. Like that that mm. time period, I was like so nostalgic for that time. It was yeah. so innocent. And those songs, there was an auto-tune. No. So a lot of it had to do with the character. Like it was an identity you can latch on yeah. to. If it's like Alanis Morissette or if it's Backstreet, but whatever, it was just such a, a strong. A strong like point of view. Yeah. Their first, first acting, acting job. job. 30 Rock? Because you were. Like job being like I got paid for it? Yeah, like an acting. Because yeah, I you guess were it's... writing it and then weren't you in it? Or no? That's No, it's true. I was on, on a 30 Rock episode. I guess I was in plays and stuff, but I guess on TV. No, yeah, no. Yeah. Yeah, it might be the first first one. <sighs> well, you're in Cali. I was about to say, if you're in New York, I'd be like, Law I and was Order. in New York. Law and Order. But that, no, but no TV in New York. I was doing mm, theater, plays. and then in LA, I my first no, one was CW. No, CW. Heart of Dixie. I played a Southern Asian. <laughs> <laughs> I like that the hero is like, what's and, my character's wait, name? Wait, truly I had Southern one. Southern Asian. I had one hmm. line and I wish I still had it, but it's like the comeback where all night she's like practicing her one line, like, and she's <laughs> eating chocolate cake. What was that app called on her? Oh, photo booth. I have photo booth videos of me saying my one line, like, you gonna take that seat? Over and over, That's all so night, cool. like in my mouth guard in the <laughs> morning. Awesome. And then Yo, they you cut have me it. from it. And then they cut <laughs> Welcome yeah. to Hollywood. Yeah, I was blown away. You got paid, didn't you? Your go-to drink order. Cappuccino? Latte. Okay, sure. I'll give it to you. <laughs> Yours is green tea right now. Or no, 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 the golden latte. There you go. Do you guys have go-to like boba orders? I mean, like if I'm just like having a good day and I want to, I just basically get the brown sugar milk, mm -hmm. like with all the fixings. I'll get it with like the boba and the jelly, oh, the custard, and the, oh, and the like, you whoa. know, the caramel. Like, but there's one called Hangover Cure. It's uh, good for like after hangover because it's a little salty, but it's got like like mm. the plum, the like dried plum at the bottom. Umeboshi? Yeah, and, mm. the, and it's so good. Mm. It's, it's it's my favorite. Whoa. Okay. I like like black tea, the black milk tea. tea, milk tea one, mm. classic. And then also on Sautel, there used to be a place and I would get the passion fruit slushy one. Passion fruit slushy with boba mm -hmm. and the Taiwanese popcorn chicken. Those uh, two as a combination is You the one who like. Did you put that in there? Uh, we're working on it. Do it. We're, I'm gonna. The popcorn though. I'm gonna. Okay. 13 out of 14. Is it, you know you your co-stars co so, so well, well they're basically, basically family. family. Yay! Oh, very sweet. Yay! Oh, ow, that really ow. hurt. <laughs> All right, thank you, BuzzFeed. Thank you. Watch Jack Reacher every <laughs> Thursday at eight. Uh, <laughs> and <laughs> Mr. and Mrs. Smith? Is that what we're promoting? I don't know anymore. Watch uh, Mr. and Mrs. Smith. Just uh, February 2nd us. on uh, Amazon Prime. Yes. We're just as goofy there as we are. <laughs> here. Mm-hmm.